This is Ghost Face Sugar and is part of the Scream 4 title by NECA. This figure is a variant with the zombie mask on uh, instead of the normal one uh, with the white mask. It said, uh, so here's the packaging. It said icon of Halloween. Here's a shot of the actual mask itself, probably in the movie. Um, but on the actual, well, on the actual figure, there's a lot of there's a lot more yellow spot on it and it is I mean it is, it is very prominent on the figure but not a lot on the actual mask itself uh, but anyway it says ghost face zombie mask and here's a 360 this figure is kind of a surprise because they never mentioned a variant being a zombie mask before there was new about this figure being released by NECA and the original figure or the prototype would have a soft rubbery plastic for the rope but they changed it because uh, this figure has leg articulation uh, but I had to say that the cloth and the leg articulation they do not work very well together on this figure probably the worst move that NECA has ever made I mean I mean this is the second prop well probably in in my experience probably the second movie figure by NECA that they get like articulation uh, but why why would they uh, give like articulation to a character with long rope I mean I mean other other movie figure that NECA had uh, really they probably deserve more leg joint than on this guy and let's take Jonah Hex for example I mean, if this guy has like articulation, you can put him in a sitting pose, put him on a horse, or a running pose. You know, an action pack character, but 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 this one, not really, because of the rope, you cannot extend the leg very far out. So very difficult to put this guy in a running pose or an open leg pose, and his his ankle joint doesn't bend forward very much. So absolutely difficult to put him in a running pose um, so this figure is like Jason uh, or Freddy Krueger you know he ch he well he looked better just standing around uh, like this with an excellent detail so let's go over articulation uh, there's a ball on it in the head and the thing I love about NECA is that they they were able to combine detail and articulation very well and and their board joint um well there a lot of board joint on the figure works very well uh, especially the head uh, he has a ball hinge shoulder ball hinge elbow uh, ball socket wrist silver at the uh, waist and let's roll up his rope here he has a ball hinge hip ball hinge knee and ball socket ankle and if you turn this guy like this you know a lot of ugly detail will be exposed so another bad thing there and uh, another thing with the rope I mean the material that they use is a see-through material and as you can see along the edge they already curved up so might not be a very good material um, so this probably you know this is probably a figure only for for the fan of the of uh, Scream movie or just a fan of NECA only and if you really couldn't uh, well you couldn't care less about this figure this is just another figure that you don't need your so just pat it right up oh and the only accessory that he comes with is the knife and it doesn't matter if you put it this way or this way well the figure will still hold it just just excellent this is probably the perfect grip on the figure I have ever seen because the fist that they designed for this figure is probably made for the knife so that's a really uh, really good thing 
so this figure um, will be available at your local Toys R Us the price range would be about uh, 15 15 dollars uh, depending on uh, your area and where you're getting him but this is probably um, as I say again probably another figure that you don't need to save your money for uh, the Gears of War 3 figures if you are a NECA fan this is for the horror fan and a fan of movie only um, but the figure itself can be very bad especially from the waist down so uh, decide for yourself if you want this figure or not um, and on which version uh, which version that you want to get also uh, so there you go recommend for the fan only and thanks for watching